Looking for you still, I'm on a mission I found her, underneath the bluest skies I found her, tangled in the hills at night I found her, all along this endless coast yeah. Found her, underneath the palm trees Where I'll be, California Found her Hey guys, so welcome back to our channel. Today we are doing the In-N-Out versus Whataburger challenge. Versus Whataburger. This is gonna be my first time trying Whataburger, you guys. I'm actually a huge fan of In-N-Out. I've always been team In-N-Out, but I guess I can't really say anything because I've never tried Whataburger. So, and he's from California. Yeah. So he's big on In-N-Out. So that's kind of how I got started with it because when I lived in Georgia, we don't have either one, so. Yeah, now that we live in Texas, Whataburger is a big thing, but in and outs also here as well, so kind of wanted to give you the best of both worlds. I think in and out in California is a lot more better than it is here in Texas, but I kind of wanted to give her the opportunity to try both. <laughs> I always say Whataburger is pretty much the bur like a Texas version of Burger King because of everything they have in the menu versus like In-N-Out where they just have hamburgers, fries, and milkshakes. Yeah, but I gotta try In-N-Out's milkshakes too though. I haven't got a chance to try it yet. What's your favorite one from In-N-Out? I like the Neapolitan. It's like a mixture of all of it. I'll have to try that one. It's yeah. really good. All right guys, comment down below and let us know which one you guys think is better. Yep. If you think Whataburger is better, which you probably do if you're from Texas. Or our favorite, <laughs> In-N-Out. But yeah, we're gonna give her a shot and we're gonna see if she likes it or not. Alright guys, so the first one we're gonna start off with is Whataburger. So, I got the hamburger. Babe. Babe. I have some as good I got hungry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I got the Whataburger. Justin wanted to try like the Southwest. Was it bacon or barbecue? No, it was like a. Um... What did I get? It has like ranch on it. Oh, I think this one's yours. It has something. <gasps> yeah, mine's the chicken. I think it has uh, cheese on it. What else is on here? Is that hot sauce? I don't know. You want to show them? I don't know. I'm kind of scared. Is this hot? I don't know, dude. That's what you wanted. I don't think it's hot sauce. Oh, I think it's, oh, it's buffalo sauce. Yeah. So, yeah, so mine's like pepper jack cheese with hot sauce and chicken. I guess I should have got a burger. It says water burger, but whatever. Yeah, and this is uh the burger. This is what it looks like. This is uh their double, I forgot what it's called, the double water burger. But, yeah, this is what it looks like. Presentation ain't much, but kind of give it a shot. What do you think? It's literally just chicken with hot sauce on it. Well, sir. Holy crap. They doused this thing in, man in uh, not mayonnaise, uh, mustard. So, so far I'm not impressed. I mean, it's okay, but... It literally just tastes like freaking chicken that's been devoured in hot sauce. This is a lot of mustard. <laughs> I don't even like mustard. <laughs> if I would have known, I would have ordered it without mustard. But what about the burger itself? Do you think the burger itself is better than that? You're not feeling it? No. I think one <laughs> reason why I like In-N-Out is because it has that such fresh taste to it. This just kind of feels like a little bit like a little bit older meat. Um, I don't know. It just doesn't have that refreshing taste to it. I'm not gonna say it's bad. I could, but just not my cup of tea. Yeah, this is something that I would get like on a road trip real quick if I was hungry. But if I was at home chilling and I was actually like craving a good meal, I would, I would get in and out. Alright guys, so the second thing we're going to try is Whataburger's fries. Uh, so. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
so quick to judge. I'm being serious. This is like worse than McDonald's fries. You know how kind of like they have like that fresh cut feel taste with that perfect amount of salt on their fries in and out? Yeah, I don't get this bun. This tastes like real soggy and like those french fries that have been sitting in your car for like a week. Oh, that's not soggy. That's more stale. <laughs> Alright guys, so now it's in and outs turn. Just look how nice that burger looks. That looks... The perfect mm. little wrapping and everything. That looks so good right there. Mmm. Mouth watering. Delicious. Are you done? Food work? But yeah. The presentation is definitely a lot better. But the taste to it is what makes it all worth it. Plus, I think their hamburgers are cheaper, too. Mm-hmm. Yep, they're better. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, we're sorry, Texas, but... Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. California, this is what you'd grab right before you go to the beach. Like, right, right at sunset. Mm. Made life ten times more better. Obviously, water motor sucks, but it's okay. It's all good. They tried. The last thing we're going to check is in and out fries. A lot of people say these are like the worst fries, but I think it depends on your taste. These are actually really good, and then they make them with... Um, Real like real potatoes like in the. It's like good. It's like what canola oil and shit too. Yeah, they use it like they make it like right inside. And then, yeah, these these aren't bad for you as much as a lot of other places. Yep. I mean, they're like the best fries that I ever had, obviously. But comparing to Waterbury, yeah. I feel like these are more um. You taste the oil more in these. Mm -hmm. With the vanilla oil, you taste it a lot stronger than you do in Wonder Burger. I think one thing I absolutely love about In N Out is their customer service, like when you go inside or when you're at the drive thru. Because they're always so nice and they're. I don't know, they're, they're just so <laughs> upbeat and then they're so nice. <laughs> what? They're always like, hey, honey, uh. Who's calling you honey? <laughs> Who was honey? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, so official winner. In and out. I'm sorry. Well I have to try I didn't have to try your patty. Your patty was that bad. Oh yeah, you wanna try it? Just look at the differences. There we go. So this one's Even falling the coloring. Out. <laughs> yeah. Just look at that. To try the water burger, my yeah, burger. All this nasty mustard in there. Oh my god! You know what this reminds me of? What? Burger King. Nah, I like. I told you, it's like a Texas version of uh, Burger King. That's what I just said. It reminds me of Burger King. I mean, the good thing about Water Burger is their soda is good. <laughs> <laughs> they, have, they have good soda, you guys. So check out their soda. It's off the chain. Alright guys, so that's the end of the video. We hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Let us know if you guys have any more restaurants you'd like us to try. or Please, because you know I could eat. Yeah, we can both eat. But, <laughs> problem is we're on quarantine now. for official orders to stay home. But, who knows where we'll be. We want to bring you guys more content, so comment down below any video ideas you guys would like to see from us. And don't forget to tell us your favorite. Yeah, let us know who's better, Whataburger or In-N-Out. Obviously, you guys know our favorite. We might be biased, but just comment down below, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Bye. Yeah.